Om Shanti. Good morning to all. Today, August 12th, 2018. Baba is saying, Dear children, don't be a beggar. So you have a right. Those who have rights for all the time, they can get easily everything, right? From our Baba. So that's why Baba is saying, don't be a beggar. So that part already has been over. Now we have a right to take everything from our Baba. So that's why Baba is saying, so in the path of devotion, we have been asking for something, right? Someone are beggar for some healthy, someone for beggar for wealth, someone or beggar for please give children to our family. So someone or beggar for death, so someone for or beggar for uh, other relations. So it depends on their need. Yeah, we were once upon a time, we were a beggar. When we were in a path of devotion, we, are, we were the beggar, but right now, we are a powerful soul. We are trying to get a equal sanskar and to get equal habits to our father. Yeah, we are trying to become equal to our father. Yeah, we have to gain those powerful behavior, those powerful sanskar from one and only the Supreme Soul. Similar to the Supreme Soul, we are also going to become, then only we can say, we are eligible to become a deity stage. Or else, that name should not fix to us, right? Yes, if we are a beggar, then no one can say, ah, oh, we are a deity. No one can say, you are a deity, you are a such powerful soul. No one can say that. So you have to become such a wonderful, powerful soul like our father. So for that, just do our remembrance of Baba and the rule of Sriman. So just keep this sentence in your mind. I am not a beggar. My beggar part has been over already. When I came to the system, already I put a full stop to my beggar part. Now I have all rights for all the time. Now I am ready to give to every soul in the world. I have such wonderful power, I have such wonderful habits, such wonderful behavior, which is similar to our Baba. So I am ready to give other soul. I am ready to make others as equal to me and as equal to Baba. So now I am an eligible person. I am an eligible soul. So you have that much thoughts you have to get in your mind. So for that you should be in soul conscious and your intellect should be in our father's behavior, in our father's sanskars. You have to see. Your third eye should see our father. Our father love. Our father's peace. So he is one and only the supreme soul. He is a ocean of knowledge. He is a ocean of love. Ocean of peace. Ocean of happiness. You can get. You can have a rights. Whenever you want, whatever you want, you can get. You can go to that ocean. You can hit how much you want. There is no limitation. Our unlimited father is giving unlimited inheritance. You have that much hand to gain that much inheritance. Yeah? Then only... You are called as a powerful soul. You have that much stock. Then only in future, you will be able to give to all the souls. 
those who are falling in sorrow those who are getting sad those who having peaceless so you're only one person right to give them yeah so you how to fill your stock so now you're not a beggar already baba has given all the rights to you you have to take it so that's why this morally is saying this sentence very important what is the sentence please children don't be a beggar you have a rights for all at all the times so just keep this sentence in your mind and spin it again and again then you never ask anything to our baba you never complain about anything because we knew this drama has already fixed it's going to repeat again and again no one can change it even our baba can change it can't change it our baba can't change it right the drama has fixed already our baba is doing his duty at right time so we are doing our duty at the right time so no one can modify and no one can delete that part which they don't want so this drama has been fixed already so we knew already baba have been teaching already before 5000 years also we have been taking this class from our baba so again baba is coming now and telling and is sitting in front of us he is telling every story of the world so you have that much confident on you you were a lakshmi narayana and before 5000 years now you are going to become that lakshmi narayana and again so for that only you are doing effort if you have you have that much confidence on you then only you are eligible to get a high status so you should not complain about anything about anyone to our supreme soul because he is keep on saying this drama is already fixed nothing new so everything he is telling again and again then why are you complaining about anything whatever it is doesn't matter but you should not complain you should not complain to our baba just take it easy and cross it you go towards your aim and objective that is your duty right now with the help of baba you can do anything you can do any kind of maya any kind of problem okay you have to conquer it off your bad thing bad thoughts negative thing negative thoughts you have to conquer it off your five vices lust anger ego attachment greed you have to renounce those thing for that for that who has rights they never complain about anything they never come in under the five vices they are in a stable stage are you are you in a stable stage just think just take a moment and think what is your stage right now how much you would effort you should put just think okay okay and next baba says you are a best ever to all the souls in the world those who are coming and asking for their peace for their happiness so for them you are a best ever you should be in that stage baba is saying and also baba said you are a stick of sandalwood right yeah previously we were in the different kind of sticks but right now you are a sticks of sandalwood tree you have to uh, spread that kind of fragrance to everyone that means this knowledge of fragrance 
this sanskar of fragrance this power of fragrance this love of fragrance you have to spread such kind of fragrance to everyone because everyone likes the sandal right yes they will come automatically to you they will come automatically in front of you you have such a wonderful fragrance to spread okay okay the next in order to become a victorious jewels what what should you have for that you should have a faith in our baba yeah the foundation for all the powers is a faith if you have 100% each faith on our supreme soul on our on this drama on this jewelry then you're you're not saying that you're a movable stage yeah you should be in a movable stage if you have 100% each faith you can see you're in a movable stage unshakable stage no one can shake or move you away from our baba okay do you have such wonderful faith on our father yes we are having such wonderful faith 100 percentage faith and we are following our shreemad to get the high status in the golden age yeah we are a lakshmi narayan and before 5000 years it's already fixed no one can change it so you have that much confidence on you okay okay next baba says the powerful time of amrita vela the powerful other that mean important important thing about amrita vela so dear children how much importance are you giving to the amrita vela time amrita vela thoughts just think do you have that much intoxication in the amrita vela time do you just think in the amrita vela you have to fly in the flying stage you are an angel no need to complain any problems at about anything it might be in your family it might be in our society it might be with your relation whatever it is you never complain about anything to our baba in the amrita vela time so you should have to know about the important of amrita vela time and important of amrita vela thoughts how your thoughts should be in amrita vela time it's just like incognito yeah you have to forget about yourself forget about this old world and your flying angel with our shiva baba so that much intoxication that much interest should be there in your amrita vela time okay baba said since you are getting blessing from me then why should you come down in the amrita vela time so just think just know about importance of amrita vela and importance of others make them as greatest like you okay as equal to you that is your duty okay next baba says powerful slogan what is the greatest of our life that is the power of truth right yes through that only all the souls in in the world bow automatically in front of you so you have such wonderful power of truth through your words through your eyes through your face through your behaviors yeah you're ready to show that through your everything that such wonderful power of truth one and only our supreme soul can give the power of truth no one can give that right yes 
if you do that kind of behavior in your daily basis so every souls in the world they can bow automatically in front of you okay okay om shanti thank you thank you baba thank you so much i love you